Did you know that sodium ion batteries are cheaper and more efficient than traditional lithium ion batteries? Bide, a Chinese automotive company, is investing $1.4 billion in a new sodium ion battery facility in Suzhou. This move is seen as a challenge to Tesla in the electric vehicle industry. Bide has already surpassed Tesla in terms of EV volume and is now focusing on battery manufacturing. The company aims to produce sodium ion batteries specifically for electric vehicles, with a focus on micro vehicles and scooters. Bide subsidiary, FinDream's battery has partnered with High Group to build the Suzhou sodium battery plant, making it the hub of battery production for micro vehicles and scooters. Partnership between Bide and a high group has led to positive outcomes before. In November 2022, they collaborated to build a battery plant in Suzhou. The plant produces blade batteries using LFP chemistry. They invested 10 billion yuan in this project, starting construction in January the previous year. The factory, spanning 310,000 SKM, is nearly finished. Trial production is set to start by March 2024. This successful partnership lays a strong foundation for their future collaborations in the EV and battery industry. Initially, rumors suggested that the Bide Seagull would be the first vehicle with a sodium ion battery. However, the car was launched with a standard Elf Blade battery instead. Despite the switch, Bide has not commented on the rumors or their plans for sodium ion batteries. Watch my video on the Bide Seagull EV by clicking the link in the description. Sodium ion batteries may not be ideal for larger EVs due to lower energy density, but they show promise for smaller vehicles. Vehicles do not need high energy density because they are not used for long distance travel. Sodium ion batteries could be a good option for storing energy in power grids. The size of the battery is not a big issue for power grid storage, as it needs to store a lot of energy. Sodium ion batteries have unique characteristics that make them suitable for this purpose, providing a viable alternative to lithium batteries. According to Bloomberg, NEF using sodium batteries could reduce the demand for lithium significantly helping to create a more sustainable energy storage landscape. Sam Adam from Crew Group Consultancy believes that sodium ion batteries could help balance the supply and demand of lithium, reducing price volatility in the market. The current challenge in sodium ion batteries is to improve their cycle life, which refers to the number of times they can be charged and discharged before needing replacement. Sodium ion batteries currently have a cycle life of about 5,000 cycles, which is impressive but falls short compared to lithium batteries that offer around 7,500 cycles. Bridging this gap between sodium ion and lithium ion batteries is the main challenge. Analysts believe that if this hurdle can be overcome, there could be an increase in the demand for sodium ion batteries. Currently, Chinese manufacturers dominate the sodium-based cell production sector thanks to their large-scale operations that result in lower operational costs. This gives them a competitive edge over European and American competitors. However, with BYD shifting to sodium ion production, the competitive landscape is expected to change creating new opportunities for manufacturers and driving further research and development in sodium ion batteries. Share your thoughts on the potential of sodium ion batteries in the comments section below. Sodium ion batteries are making waves in the energy storage market. Do you believe this move will solidify BYD's position in the industry or will it create opportunities for other manufacturers to compete? How will this affect Tesla? If you liked the video, remember to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and turn on notifications to stay updated on new content. Goodbye.